What's up, God Gamer Dish? Uh, hi. I took a look at the upcoming horror dungeon crawler RPG Hibernaculum from Wormwood Studios and Victor Flug. I know I said that wrong, but don't be angry with me and let's just move past it, please. Creators of such hits as Primordia and Strangle... Strange Land. Two atmospheric adventure games with a gorgeous, goopy retro art style and depressing cerebral subject matter. Since I'm easily swayed by just being told games I know, this game seeks to meld the old-fashioned groping around in the dark of Eye of the Beholder and similar classics with the RPG elements of CRPGs, alongside the unsettling and sudden grotesquerie of the Waxworks games. And finally, they cite System Shock 2 and Resident Evil 2 as reference points for the game's survival horror elements. A lofty goal. Can they pull it off? Probably. They clearly know uh, what they're doing. Look at that shit. What's that? I don't know. But I don't like it. Appropriately, the game doesn't yet have any kind of coherent plot synopsis so much as it has a lot of flavor text about the setting and the tone. It's set on a massive labyrinthine spaceship that is so old nobody even remembers what its name is or what its purpose was. Its inhabitants have just cobbled together a makeshift civilization in the depths of a rotting, stinking, pissy, biomechanical dungeon. More of the history, goings-on, and grim dark musings will be explored in audio files and journals littered throughout, as well as NPCs to talk with, barter with, murder with, and murder on. You play as a character that was in hibernation for an unknown span of time and wakes up to, needless to say, things not looking like they did when they went in. It's kind of like Red Dwarf, but like, the humor's more dry. I, I don't know. Okay, it's not like that at all. You know what, I'll just say it is, and if I'm wrong, what is that? Is, is that off-brand? Cards on the table, I've broken format here. I don't so much have a demo of this game as much as I have a very early build that was slipped under the table, and it shows off a couple bits of functionality, but not much. This was certainly neat to look at and get a feel for the oppressive and alien vibe Wormwood is going for. But most of what you're seeing right now is promotional clips and whatnot from a version I do not have. Except for this part where there was a Giger-esque grimace that killed me. It's okay, I eventually figured out how to shoot him. This is something that can only be done through the magic of video games because as we all know, nothing can kill the grimace. This does look way cooler in the footage of the current build though because you actually see a weapon outstretched in front of you. This level of body awareness in a dungeon crawler is pretty novel. I'm really excited to see how the gameplay turns out because from what I've read it sounds like a really earnest attempt at not only capturing and distinguishing a nostalgic genre, but grafting on bits and pieces from others along with modern conveniences. So ideally you get the joy of playing a retro dungeon crawler without many of the barriers to entry or unintuitive design choices that could use a little quality of life tweaking. Glad we're getting a detailed interactive map because the layout of this place uh, gives me anxiety just looking at it. It's like a shirt from Dan Flashes. But obviously the immediate thing I've latched onto without much gameplay reference is the beautiful art and the way it has seeped into the UI like some kind of creeping biomass. Especially nice to see in this era where UI design seems to be exclusively authored by cowards. Cowards that want their game to look like an app on your goddamn telephone instead of a spooky adventure. Oh, where does this video come from? Uh, why the game's Kickstarter page, which is still up collecting funds for the game's development for a little over a week, uh, provided I upload this on time. So I don't mean to alarm you, but you should be panicked right now. You gotta get in there and you gotta get in now, otherwise you're out of here, bozo. You don't get in on the ground floor of this Lynchian nightmare scape. I guess this is like another situation where I'm like technically doing an ad, but I'm not getting paid for it. So I should just, I should just own it. Don't, don't walk, walk, run to kickstarter.com slash projects slash hibernaculum game slash hibernaculum dash survival dash horror dash RPG. Also buy Primordia and Strangeland. I think they're on sale. They were the last I checked, but, but they, they might, might not be now. now. Give, Give me a second, second I'll, I'll check, check again. again. Give me a minute. That's not how you spell that. Still on sale. Even if it isn't by the time you hear this, then uh, buy, buy them, them anyway. anyway. <laughs>